G'day guys, how's it going? It's Blood Teeth here, bringing you another video of StarCraft 2. And in today's video, I'm going to be playing as a cheesy Protoss on the ladder. Yep, that's right, it's all about the cannon rushes and all of those other cheesy moves, you know, Zealot rushes, Void Rays, you know, all that Florencia stuff that people who <laughs> are on the other end of this particular stick, they don't like it, they think it's cheesy, they think, um... They, they always um, complain as well when they lose to such cheesy strats. I love it. Just because, like I said, I have no talent. So, here we go. Playing as Protoss. Annoying the world. I'm on the America server, by the way. And I'm not very familiar with any of the new maps. I only just started playing last night. In fact, I tried to record this. And I realized that when I took a recording using Freecam, <laughs> for some reason, it recorded a black screen. The only thing you could see was the cursor moving around. So that was a fail. But I've just tested it in windowed mode and it works. So, first victim, please be Protoss. Please be Protoss. This is so much easier against Pro ah. Okay, Terran, this is not going to be easy. Um, this is going to be a quick cheese that will have to morph into some sort of... Whoa, caps locks. Um, yeah, this will be a quick cheese that may have to warp into some sort of macro game. Because honestly, trying to cheese against Terran is not the easiest. Okay, where would you be? So I need to somehow be about here. Alright. Let's get that forge going. Bang. Now. You have not enough minerals. Like any good cheesy Protoss with no skill. I actually forgot to build poor probes. Whoops. <laughs> okay. We're pretty much in position. What we have to do now is just... Just do this. And really hope that they didn't place a supply depot here. Hopefully here first. Let's also just pick up. Okay. Yep. He knows. He's against Protoss. He's not taking any chances. He, she, it, whoever. Who am I playing against? Ah, uh, whatever. You have not enough let's not care about that. Instead, let's care about... This. Oh yes, you my friend are screwed. A bunker, sure, no problems. Let's go then. Pick up the ramp to give us vision, and straight away, he's pretty much, he's gone. Ooh, yes, didn't even finish the bunker. Oh, that sucks for him. Okay. Let's not dilly dally about. Let's also start to get our macro up. Ah, oh, lovely. You're not going to repair that? No, you're not. You, my friend, suck. Okay. Lovely. Oh, that volume's loud, isn't it? But. Let's just see, what did this person, what were they doing? Okay, so they were just doing bunkers. In range of the cannons. Um. Let's fix that. Volume, jeez. Okay. Uh, sound. Let's bring it down to 23, 23, so that I can talk. Yeah, that's a bit better. Okay, um, pro tip. If someone's doing a cheesy cannon rush on you, don't build your bunkers in range of the cannons. There's no point to try and stop these cannons if they're all down here. Uh, so long as you make sure that anything that comes up here in the ramp, like say, or oh, I don't know, a probe, um, if you make sure that gets cut down and there's no access to the top, so even if I've got a pylon up here, you can just stand back and just clout everything here and be safe from these cannons. These cannons... They're static defense. They can just sit there. So, honestly, 
that was a bit of a mistake. Um, tried to get the second bunker up and running, but it was just too little too late. My probe was already in there. It was already building uh, pylons. Yeah. Good times. All right. Let's go again. And this time, let's hope we get Protoss. Because Protoss, they can't really and don't really wall off. Their buildings don't lift. And they don't have creep like Zerg. So, um, cannon rushing, I find especially if you're not spotted, is the easiest thing to do against Protoss. The hardest thing to do against Protoss, though, is to try and also keep an eye out and defend yourself against a cannon rush as well. It's something to be weary of. Mm. And you can hate on me in the comments all you want. I don't really care. I'm the reason why Protoss has such a bad name. I used to cannon rush back when uh, I was playing StarCraft and Brood War. It's fun. It's cheap. It's easy. It's brain dead uh, strategies. Ah, here we go. My graphics card's about to die. Are we still going? Okay, let's just pretend we are. Oops. And here I am stuffing up already. Okay, against Zerg, a cannon rush is not easy at all. Um, really difficult. Because of that damn creep. Okay. In fact, let's send another probe out. What's going on here? Sure, let's give ourselves lots of probes. Uh oh. The Zergs are not doing anything, so... Alright, you know what? <laughs> Stuff for you. I'm going to keep you on one base. Because I'm a prick. <laughs> what are you going to do? What are you going to do? Oh, you'll go down for the third. That's what you'll do. Oh, I knew it. Frickin' Zerglings. Our pylon is under attack. Oh, this cheesy bugger. Okay. Can I wall this off? Uh, not very effectively. Okay. Um. Hmm. You must I knew it. Twelve pulling against me. Cheeky little bugger. Alright, this is going to take a slight amount of skill, not much, but a slight amount. Okay, cannon, cannon, and you stay there and attack. That's right, come to your deaths. Lovely. Ooh, can't hear anything other than the voice. That kind of sucks. Alright. Let's put a cannon here. Lovely. Oh, you're going to morph into Banelings, are you? Sure, no problems. Let's just hope he's not looking and lure him into his death here. And... Lovely. Alright. And let's make the world's most ridiculous looking maze. Alright, now that I've done that and thwarted his initial attack, let's get some sort of thing going. And also remember that we actually have stuff going on here. Lovely. It's not quite as close as I wanted it, but hey. Whatever. Now, I've got to put a cannon here. Lovely. <laughs> you were not expecting that, were you? Oh, it's like poetry. Let's just do this. Yep. 
and one over here, just so nobody can sneak attack these pylons down. And we're pretty much done on that side. Now, let's hope he's so distracting. Uh oh, hello. That's funny. Your probes are under attack. Yeah, that's fine. I can just warp in here later. <laughs> Loving this. This is a stupid game, by the way. If any pro actually sees this, they'll be like, oh, God. Yeah, face palming. Face palming like crazy, because this is a stupid strat. And I should, in fact, actually do this. Let's get more. Put a pylon there, backup pylon, just in case. And... Okay. So, it looks like I could go Void Rays, or I could go the really long route and just do DTs. What are the chances this guy is going to get overseers though? Oh, okay. And they got a hatchery. They're one basing, just like me. And I've got four gates up, so... You know what? DTs it is. Yeah, I know what's going on here. You're going to try and do one of those uh, cheeky little nidises on me, aren't you? Most likely. Let's just get some vision all around. Let's get that Cybercore's warp gate research up and running. bases they have. Probably a few. If they didn't lose their nerve then they're probably just trying to essentially macro up instead of trying to just one base get some sort of defense expecting me to rush in a whole bunch of stalkers or something. Which would be stupid on my part, because let's be honest, this guy's gone nuts with the um, spine crawlers. Oh, you know what? If I could just rush in and get the economy only, Research that would be complete. perfect. I tell you what, I've got a nice amount of gas for this DT rush. Which is more of a, a DT walk, let's be honest. This is not very fast at all. Uh, should I? Uh, let's see. Four DTs cost 500 gas. Nah. I'm going to wait. I'm going to try and get eight DT... Buggers. I knew it. Huh. What to go for? He doesn't know. Okay. Good move. Jeez, am I going to get DTs up for this? Yes! Alright. And if I can get 8 DTs, this guy is totally screwed. Because I can just walk in, clout all of their uh, drones, come down From here, clout all of their drones. And then they'll be forced to do nothing but defend. At which point I'll just go ahead and get a lot of zealots and um, you know, shut that down pretty quick. Alright, come on. Come on. Give me that gas, give me that cooldown. I'll tell you what, this is going to work out perfect. Fear is an illusion. You require more Vespine gas. Uh oh. Oh no, there is no vision. From the shadows I come. Is there vision? He's going for vision. I've got him. No, I don't got him. Damn it. Alright. That was a fail. What next? You know what? Screw this. Brute force. 
that's what's next. This is not going well. <laughs> I may have underestimated this person just a little bit. Alright. You require more this being gas. Yep, yep. On it. No problem. Just do lots of zealots. Um I do need a sentry for that damage reduction on the roaches. And you know what? I'm just gonna walk over. Last chance. Effort. You require more Vespine gas. I am here in the shadow. Alright. This is a terrible army. Let's go ahead and attack with this. See how we go. I didn't get blink, I didn't get charge. Oh man. This is just suicide, this run. You have not enough minerals. You have not enough Where are the minerals? There they are. Speaking of minerals. Let our enemy know our fuel. Ah, bugger. Oh, look at you trying to spread your creep. Got in shield. Lovely. Cold is the void. I am the voice. <laughs> I'm screwed. Eclipse. See, this is what happens when you do one base and you don't try and get your um, economy up and running. You end up behind, and even when you do finally try some sort of attack, it has to be cheesy and effective. If it's not, you're behind and you're screwed. <laughs> Fair enough. Alright, let's go for one more. I want to play against a Protoss, damn it. Preferably a Protoss that also tries the same cheesy strat. I want to see what happens. Because that's always an interesting match. When you're both cannon rushing, who can shut down the cannon rush first? Who can survive? Those sorts of games can sometimes turn into a really crappy fight that just lasts forever. Yes! How's that for luck? A gold Protoss. Gold Protoss means cannon rusher, for sure. Alright. Like have fun. Up, oh, my display driver has to crap itself. Yep. Okay. Now that that's done. That. Where's the path? There it is. <laughs> Lovely. All right. Now, could wall off here. Could wall off up here. So we're going to go over here, just for the moment. Fastest forge, but fast forges are not an issue. Worthy of a tissue. So I'm going to do something mega cheesy. I'm going to put one here. Sneaky cannons down here. Go up here and build a cross. Let's see if this guy's done anything. What's what's going on? What is Gold Protoss's MO? A gateway. That's interesting. Oh, crapping himself already. Love it. <laughs> uh oh, uh oh. Probe's struggling. Your probes are under attack. Ah, I gotta send another one over. Lovely. Alright, while that's happening, let's actually pretend to macro. Just in case. It's always nice to have a small backup plan, even if it's a small one. Alright. 
Come on, Probius. You can do it. Meanwhile. Yeah, oh. No, let's leave a two gap. Because why not? Why not? Uh oh. Well, that worked. Alright, they're choking. Although they are getting their cyber core up. Which kind of sucks for me. I think he knows what I'm trying to do here. I think that's going to be too little too late. So, let's go ahead and get our cyber up. Like I said, let's get our cyber up. Cyber is up. And let's also think about a backup plan for expansions as well. Your probes are under attack. <laughs> How did that happen? Dude! You just let me put three cannons up in your base. You're a nut. Ah, I'll cancel that. No, didn't cancel it. Whoops. Okay, A cannons up. Oh, defensive cannons. Interesting choice. Oh, I'm getting a lot of probes. I'm getting a lot of probes. That's awesome. That's really funny. I can't believe it went down like that. I got a cannon up. And, uh-oh, no, get the probe. Okay, that's enough of those shenanigans. Alright, let's get a real economy going here. Oh, cheeky, cheeky little bugger. Alright, you want to play those games, do you? Oh... little bit ahead which is perfectly fine I love it more oh you think you're good you think you're funny Cannon some time. All right. Base is under attack. Lovely. That's going to win. You have not enough minerals. You have not enough minerals. Base is under attack. <laughs> Is this within range? Damn, it is. Alright, how about that? That's not, which is good. You have not enough minerals. Okay. You have not enough minerals. I'm broke. I'm screwed. Ooh. I have two Nexus though, which is good. So they can warp in DTs or whatnot. Which is not good for me. I need to... Yep. What's that? Ah, oh, it's just a stalker. No worries. Our pylon is under attack. Okay. Base is under attack. <laughs> Let's, let's wait for the arrogant reply. <laughs> What's it going to be? Hmm? Do I have enough funds to stop this little attack? I 
think I might. Yeah, I do. That's funny. You have not enough oh, and Ginny here thought it was over. What a shame. Base is under attack. You have not enough minerals. <laughs> oh, wow. Just gonna razz him up a bit. Base is under attack. Yeah, they're going to blink up. Okay, sure. Why not? This person's going to give me stick for it. You know what? Screw them. I'm just going to do this. I'm going to shore up the defenses even more. Because why not? Your probes are under attack. Oh, perfect. <laughs> you have not enough minerals. <sighs> now, I could actually cheese out a Stargate. Nah, let's break it. Let's break everything. I can't believe I've even lasted this long. This guy kind of sucks. Pump out a couple of immortals and... Break this. And then break out of here, which means I'll have to take down a gate. Mineral field depleted. I am getting broke though, which is not cool. This person has any brains at all, they will be getting a shuttle. What is it? A warp prism, sorry. And just fly right here to the back and clout everything, or they would be getting a void rays or some sort of air. Like, um, oh, you know what would be cool? To see them do tempests. Come on, do tempests, you cheeky bugger. Show me you're just as cheesy as me. Flying glass cannons. Just just for the style points. Do it for the grand. <laughs> so I've got shield batteries here to heal up any mortals. I could easily break this. Easily. I return to serve. We shall serve forever. Our cannon shall sink. I return to serve. You're damn straight I say good game and then don't leave. Glory is it I feel your presence. It is 
I could actually warp prison them out. I return to serve. Yeah. Okay, this might work. Oh man, I'm dangerously low on minerals. So you know what? All I have to do is build a shield battery here or something like that and just keep going in. With what little minerals I have left. Oh, that's not too bad. Come on, we got one and a half grand. That's heaps. Mineral field depleted. <laughs> and a stalker. Why not? Because why not? Come on, give me that juicy stalker. Let's go. He's probably just macroing up, making this most massivest army ever. This is not going to go well, by the way. Not at all. Oh, okay. Come on. Come to your death. Thank you. Thank you very much. What have we got here? Yep, another stalker. Sure. Oh, you can't catch me if I do this. Is there a base here? Yep, of course there is. Mineral field depleted. Alright. thy bidding. <laughs> Holy crap, the number of immortals is ridiculous. Okay. That's enough StarCraft cheese. Unfortunately, I had the least luck against the Protoss player. That sucked. Eh, what you gonna do? That's what happens with cheese. Unless you're incredibly good at it, like Florencio, you're not gonna do well. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. And let me know if you want to see anything else. Catch you later, guys.